Here we have the 50 caliber annealing system that we've been working on. Um, standard cabinet, uh, injection chute, annealing coil. On the side we have a reservoir with water for cooling. Uh, there's the hopper at the top with the carousel in board. Can't see it from this angle. Um, feed chute, power on off switch. Just turn it on. Uh, controls at the very top consist of start button, reset button and status indicators for where the system is in the process. We'll just give it a start and uh, if we look up here we can see the carousel is moving around so we'll just feed a bunch of shells into the top of the chute and it'll pick up the shells orientated in the right uh, direction which will be bottom of the shell first Pop it in and there we have the first shell entering the annealing system in the background we can see 4.8 volt which is the indicator for the 5 volt supply 11.9 volts indicated for the 12 volt supply uh, power supply running at 27 volts uh, the first shell is just annealed have a look in the background, we can see it operating at uh, going up to 15 towards 16 amps. It'll work its way up to 450 watts. And uh, once it gets to 750 degrees, it'll be ejected. And uh, we'll just look at the last shell coming through and then we'll pause the video. And that was the last shot right here. You can hear it hissing and see the annealing on each shell. And this is the 50 caliber annealing system.